favorite ingredients to use during the holidays is cranberries. The fresh cranberries are available and they're great to use in so many things other than just our traditional Thanksgiving cranberry sauce. So what I'm making here today is a cranberry balsamic glaze that you can put over pork tenderloin or pork chops or whatever. So I've got a pork chop here that I've seared off and what I'm going to do is I'm going to make my sauce here and this is just um, some whole cranberries and apple and onions that I've sauteed together and then I'm just going to put in a little bit of brown sugar let that caramelize since the whole fresh cranberries are you know they're pretty tart so you usually need a little bit of sugar in with them and then this is a little bit of balsamic vinegar and orange juice and I'm going to use this to deglaze my pan and that gets all the little brown bits off the bottom of the pan and all the good flavor going and not too much balsamic vinegar because that come, tends to be a little overwhelming. And then I'm going to get in some fresh rosemary. And then this is some chicken broth. And you're just going to get this in here and let it reduce and thicken. And it'll be sort of like a chunky barbecue sauce. So we're going to let our sauce cook down and then we'll come back and start getting our pork ready. So I got my sauce cooked down. And what you can also do is put your pork chop in after you sear it and let it finish off in your sauce while it reduces and it'll get nice and juicy and absorb some of the sauce. And so I've already spooned some out and what I've got over here is a pork tenderloin that I seared and baked and I've also basted it some with the sauce and it's come out really nice. And I'm just gonna put it here. I've got my plate dressed up with a little rosemary and then you can just spoon more sauce over the top and then also bring it to the table for dipping spread a few cranberries around and this is so pretty this would be a nice Christmas dinner too so you can find this recipe and many more ways to use cranberries in Wednesday's flavor section of the Tyler paper and this recipe will be on CBS19.tv